using a choker hitch with a half hinge by Rigging Institute. This question comes up often. Is it okay to use a choker hitch with a half hitch to lift a long piece vertically? In this video, you will witness the brake test results of using a double wrap choker hitch with a half hitch attached to a 4 inch steel pipe and a 4 inch steel tube. A 2 inch single ply nylon web sling is used for each test. The hitch capacity and minimum braking strength is calculated as follows. The choker hitch working load limit equals 2400 pounds. We multiply that by 50 percent for the angle of choke reduction equaling a working load of 1200 pounds. Therefore the minimum braking strength in this configuration will be five times the working load limit of 1200 pounds or 6000 pounds. A brake test result of 6000 pounds or more will be a successful test for this hitch configuration. Breaking strength on this test equals 6.8 to 1. Breaking strength on this test equals 8.121. One. Now that you have seen the test results and you want to use this hitch, please note the following. Always use a double wrap choker hitch with the half hitch. Ensure there is a good 360 degrees of sling contact to the load. Some tubular steel may only load on its corners. The flat surface is often lower than the corners as tubing gets larger and may cause your hitch to slip. Use the best sling type to create the highest coefficient of friction between the sling and load. The load weight must be heavy enough to tighten the sling securely around the load. Do not use this hitch to lift bundled items. Be careful when landing the load, the hitch can slip when tension is released. Always remember to put your half hitch north of the center of gravity. Thank you.